what's going on guys so welcome again to the videos welcome again to the channel um, today we got a few things going on I have a Nissan Titan XD that I'm doing brackets for uh, horn blasters horns and I have a Mazda B2000 that just came in it has a rotary engine in it I'm doing uh, some exhaust work on that so I'm gonna come and take a look at it Yo, te, yo tengo ahí atrás. It's gonna be a before and after the exhaust. again to the channel I just want to show you guys the trunk if you guys remember this is the Mazda the Mazda B2000 I was gonna do the exhaust on uh, I finished the process already it's kind of pain but I just wanted to show you guys so as you can see I cut it right there off the header went with a three inch and I decided to cross it over. Why? Because the cutout was gonna be right there underneath. The fuel pump and fuel filter and the fuel tank is right here. So I didn't want anything to catch on fire. Plus it was gonna make it easy, a lot easier for me to just cross it over right here. Uh, so I did a V-band right here and after the V-band I did the cutout and then after that I welded more. I did a hanger there and not too happy about these hangers because they I couldn't really find any other hanger anywhere else. I went to a couple places they all had the same exact hanger so that being said that was the only thing that I could get um, but what I ended up doing I went up and then straight back and then this is what I did today you guys can't probably see it but I did like a a permanent hanger like a solid hanger right here that tees off and actually attaches to the to the factory two bolt hanger that was that was there previously I took the old stuff off and just used the supplied bolts the bolts that were already there 
and then the existing existing holes and went ahead and bolted up to there and now it's nice and solid and then did a resonator a vibrant resonator uh, this is only a 12 inch resonator it, I, uh, I should have probably went with a larger one um, I think the larger one is an 18 inch resonator that they had the vibrant has but either way I wanted to go with that and then I did a another V band that way it's easier if you want to take it off in section went over the solid axle and then I ended up actually having to make this little adapter because this is oval this is round but I I don't I didn't have an app an adapter for that plus three this is three and a half you know not four it's not three it's three and a half so I went from three to three and a half and I actually ended up having to make that and it worked it worked just fine and then I did another hanger on this side so like I said it doesn't really move that much over here is plenty solid this hanger is pretty much not doing anything but who knows something happens one of the other hangers failed and you always have that one right there so I'm gonna try to start it up do a quick start up um, just to you guys will be able to see the difference I'll probably put the first start up and then the second start up so